come on. Day 89, salt with Guys, you. Pete here. Jesus tells this story in Luke chapter 7, verse 41. He says this, Two people owed money to a certain money lender. One owed him $500 and the other $50. Neither of them had the money to pay him back. So the money lender forgives their debt. Now, which of them will love the money lender more? Now, Simon answered, well, I suppose the one with the biggest debt forgiven. And Jesus says, you have judged correctly. So the person that owed the most is forgiven more. The person that owes the most loves the person who has forgiven them. Now, I don't know about you, but I've met people in my life that find that their sin is way too big for God to love them. People have said to me, look, God couldn't love me because you don't know what I have done. You don't know the things I've done in my life. There is no way anyone could forgive me. Now, if that's you, if you feel that you have done things that can never be forgiven, I want to remind you of one thing. God is like that money lender and he's saying, hey, I'm forgiving you everything because he wants you to know his extravagant love. And he wants you to reciprocate that extravagant love back to him because he loves you that much. He will rip, a, rip down walls. He will rip up rocks. He will break chains in your life to show you how much he loves you. So I want to encourage you today, if you don't think you can ever be loved by God because of what you've done, you are wrong. He loves you just the way you are. He loves you just the way you are. He doesn't expect anything from you but to reciprocate that love, accept that love, and start the journey of relationship with him. God bless you. Have a great day.